I heard this bang outside, and you know the way like Brian got robbed a couple weeks ago next door. So I've been like more paranoid, I guess, since I've been at home a lot. And uh, so I went over and like moved the curtain out of the way, and I was all like freaking out. What do you mean curtain? We don't have curtains. Well, whatever. The blinds. You know what I meant. Well, then just call them blinds. Well, okay, fine. They're blinds. Well, you know what I meant when I said curtain. Well, then why did you say curtain? But They're I, blinds. I don't know, because it's like a synonym to blinds. I just couldn't think of the word blinds at that moment. No, it's not really a synonym. So is it someone trying to break in? It's, it's totally a synonym. If you wrote, like, what's a synonym to curtains, people would probably write blinds. No, uh, they would say drapery. Drapery blinds. is more just like the umbrella that encompasses all of these things. No, those are not drapery. But whatever, man. It's the blinds. So I moved the Were blinds out. Were you thinking of getting curtains? No, I wasn't. You know yeah. what I meant, right? Yeah. Regardless of all that I moved the blinds out of the way. How did you do that? I pushed them to the side. The whole thing to the side? Enough to put my face between the window and the blinds. You know the way the blinds hang in front of the window? Yeah. Basically I moved it like that. I didn't like do the strength thing because I wanted to quickly do it because I thought there might have been some sort of like prowler or whatever outside. Like the car? No, like a deviant or a perpetrator or whatever. Like, like. Well, which is a deviant or a perpetrator? Mm, I don't know which it was because I hadn't found out yet. So, do you think it was probably a potential perpetrator? Which would be a suspect. Anyway, I thought it was some asshole trying to rob next door. Now he's an asshole. <laughs> well, I d I bet, I'm sure if if someone's gonna rob the house, they're probably not like a nice, courteous person or well, whatever. You don't even know he could be. Courteous. Maybe he's just down and out. Yeah, whatever. The money. Well, I'd prefer them not to be down and out and steal from our neighbors and us. What if maybe his grandmother needs surgery and he needs money to pay for that? Well, he's not really gonna get much money for like surgery for stealing a DVD player or like a laptop. He just needs enough money to pay for the copay. Well, if it was just like a checkup, I guess you could totally steal a DVD player because then that's like 30 bucks. Maybe like just a tooth cleaning? That'd be different because dental's a different insurance thing. Well, then which one is it? Because I want to know if your story. I don't know which one it was. I don't even know if it was like the guy has health insurance. Matter of fact, I, I so didn't even. So a guy. I, at the time, I didn't even know if it was a person. It could have been a uh. spaceship for all I knew. All I knew was like, I heard banging outside, and I went to check out what it was. So I moved the curtains out of the way or blinds. whatever, and looked out the window or the blinds, whatever. So that's why I went outside the window, or I didn't go outside the window. You I went looked. outside the window. I didn't go outside the window. So why wouldn't you just go out the door? I'm not gonna come out the door and make myself obvious. You know what well, I'm saying? Instead of going out the window. I'm like, I didn't go out the window. You I just, looked out the window. You just said you went out the window. I well, whatever. I'm getting tripped up because you're aggravating me. Oh. I apologize for aggravating you. No, you don't, because if you cared that much, you just wouldn't aggravate me to begin with. Why don't you just be quiet and listen to the story, Mike? I actually don't even care if you hear the rest. I, mean, I don't really you... care anymore, either. Okay, Fun great. Up. Well, maybe I just won't finish the story, then I guess I want to hear it. Well, you sure as hell don't act like it. I'm trying, to en I'm trying to engage you. Whatever. So, I moved the blinds out of the way to see what was outside. I didn't see, like, an intruder or a prowler or whatever, and, like, I tried to look at Brian's place the best angle I could to see if there was anything, because that's why I didn't want to go to the door, because if it was a dude trying to break and I don't want him to see me so that way I could just like call the police from the safety of the living room mm -hmm. it was also like not that I want him to rob the place but if he saw me he would take off before the police could get there do you think he would take off because of you or not uh, don't slow him down I don't... anymore so anyway I moved the blinds away from the window to peek out the window to see if it was like a dude robbing the place and all it actually was was just the mailman dropping off the hockey sticks he had ordered oh huh, good thanks pretty exciting well, you made it sound like it was going to be more exciting than it was. All I was trying to make the point is is that since they got robbed next door, I've been more paranoid lately. But it turned out to be nothing. Well, then why didn't you just say that?